Come with me as we check out Carver 47, a charming food and wellness market that's open for breakfast and lunch and located in Bronzeville. I ordered a latte, avocado toast, and a Carver's breakfast, and I spent a total of $35, including tip. I am a sucker for the heart that they put on top of the latte. My latte was absolutely delicious. It was warm. It was creamy. It was nice and strong. I loved it. The avocado toast was topped with goat cheese, cherry tomatoes, and microgreens. My initial reaction was it was a little expensive because I only got one piece. However, the toast was absolutely delicious. The bread was nice and crispy. The avocado was fresh. The goat cheese was not overpowering, and I am not a fan of goat cheese. The tomatoes were nice and delicious. This toast was absolutely scrumptious, but it still gets a side eye for being $12. On to my main course. It came with a big bowl of fresh fruit, two sausage patties, grits, scrambled eggs, and toast. I just wanted you all to see the plating. I love this design. I'm going to go into these grits first. I rarely order grits in restaurants because even though they offer grits, it doesn't mean that they can properly cook grits. Upon my initial tasting of these grits, the texture was pretty much perfect. They were nice. They were soft. You could tell that they cooked these with butter and they cooked them properly. However, they did lack seasoning. Let's get into these eggs. The eggs were nice and fluffy, a gorgeous color, so someone knew what they were doing back there. However, the eggs lacked a little salt as well. Time to taste my sausage. The sausage was delicious. It's everything you wanted from a pork sausage. Very fresh, very tender. The sausage was smoking hot, tasty, seasoned well. Yeah, I love the sausage. Now, I really wanted to enjoy my breakfast, so I did need to add a little bit of salt a little bit of pepper, and I wanted to go back in and see if that helped, and it absolutely did. All it needed was salt. The eggs were delicious. The grits, like I said, they were cooked very properly. They were just missing salt. Time to get into this toast. I ordered a pepper jam to go along with my toast. It's this sweet jam that had little bits of pepper, and upon tasting it, I really, really enjoyed the taste of it. It was nice and sweet, and it also had a little spice to it. You can see the little peppers in the jam. The test is to put everything together. You put everything on one fork and see what it tastes like in your mouth, and that's exactly what I did. And I was not disappointed. Everything tastes delicious. It was as if I was at home eating, and I can cook. So that is definitely a compliment. The food was delicious. The fruit bowl did not disappoint either. It was very large and it was filled with delicious fresh fruit, blueberries, blackberries, and strawberries. They were scrumptious. Taking all things into consideration, including the taste and quality of the food, the preparation and presentation of the food, also the friendliness of the staff and the prices, I am going to give Carver 47 an 8.2 out of 10. I definitely recommend. I'm full.